my first stream I averaged like 10 to 20 viewers and now I average like 10,000 viewers so it's absolutely insane. Clicks showing off why he is one of the most consistent solo players. You're watching ESPN Esports and I am here with 14 year old Misfits Clicks. He's a great player, he's got a lot of motivation, he works really hard. I'm dead, I'm dead. Let's go! It's a work ethic, it's just out there. Check out scary well. easy yeah. for yeah. Clicks. There's, I yeah. mean, scary easy. You want to know why he's the top, Jack? That's why he's the that's top it. right That's it right there. I'm Clicks. I'm 14, and I play Fortnite professionally. Ever since I was a little kid, I loved playing video games. I would say I probably stream or play like six to 12 hours a day. His brother was always interested in Call of Duty and Counter-Strike. And I remember seeing Cody always looking and watching his brother, asking him a lot of questions. I got into Fortnite when my brother introduced it to me. Before I started streaming, I was probably playing Fortnite for maybe five to six months. The only video game I play is Fortnite because I feel like if I play another game, my sensitivity will be off. Fortnite is different from other games because there's like building, there's mechanics, you could always get better. With like other games like Call of Duty, you just make your aim better. I feel like Fortnite needs to get better at everything. Get a kill, get a kill, get a kill, get a kill, get a kill. Get a kill. As time went on, he kept on playing, getting more fans, more people, more subscribers, more followers on Instagram. Everything in this industry is followers, followers, followers. Chat, chat, what was one thing you guys learned in today's school? Be honest, be honest. Things that set me apart from other streamers and players is like I interact with my chat, I build a relationship with my chat, I consistently talk to new viewers, introduce them to myself, and hopefully they enjoy the stream. I love most about Fortnite is obviously like my fans supporting me, watching me, enjoying the content that I create, and I obviously love the game too. I started homeschooling because for me to stream six hours a day and compete in tournaments, I wouldn't be able to go to school. I would miss way too many days. So my schedule is a tutor comes over three days a week. I'm gonna be honest, it's kind of boring, but for me to want to do like streaming, everything like this, I have to do what I have to do. There's no problem with him working 80 hours a week, especially if you love your job. Now, as far as the schoolwork, you know, maybe that's a little less, but I guess I was the same way, you know, when I was a freshman in high school. Outside of Fortnite, obviously like hanging out with friends, playing basketball, like just enjoying my life and like seeing myself as a normal kid. Dude, what are you doing, dog? Him making a career out of video games is kind of like insane to me that he's so talented at what he does and he makes a great living out of it. Clicks right now, top of the board. All these services lands all the way up top. He's in a box with another player. It's nut. The first tournament was called the Duo World Cup. I qualified. So that day, my first tournament, I won $50,000. And I was crying because, like, I won $50,000 at the age of like 14. Ever since then, I knew that I had the potential to win money. Clicks is just going to rain down on the lobby. Everything is pointing to clicks. I look at the pro gamers today, all the kids out there, if they get that good, that professional, they're just like athletes. At this time, they're mental athletes. So it's the same thing if your son was playing AAA ball and all of a sudden he started getting up and the scouts started looking at him and he got into a minor league team and then played for a professional baseball team. So this is what this is all about. It probably took me like a year and a half to upgrade. I started off with a 60 hertz monitor, terrible PC. I wasn't sure how good he was at all. He says, Dad, if you believe in me, if you believe in this game, I could get so good at it. I could become a professional. I could make so much money. And he says, why don't you buy me this really neat gaming computer? I said, I really got to think about it right now. I can't afford it. And I says, I'll tell you what, I'll make up a contract and I'll pitch in so much money. But I says, at the end of the summer, I want to have this computer paid off. I got him the best, you know, playing computer they possibly sold. Within two and a half weeks, he showed me what he was able to make with his talent, and he brought in something like $1,035. They killed for the house. Nice. Yeah. Let's go! Oh, best play in the world! Dude, I'm like, oh, baby! Let's go! Oh. This is the Clicks gaming setup 2020. First, we have the Final Mouse Ninja Air 58 Blue, which is really good. I've been using this for a long time. Then we have the Matrix keyboards. Pink keycaps, blue switches. I have around like five of these. They keep on sending me extras. We got the HyperX mic, and then we got the Logitech 1080p HD camera. We got the stream deck, and then we got the mouse bungee right here. Then we have the 2080 Ti Alienware, and then we have the 240 hertz Alienware monitor. Two of them, matter of fact. Gunner Gamer glasses are here. Kind of funky, but it helps me out a lot. Studio headphones. This is basically my setup that I use on every single stream, every single tournament, all of that. Probably the whole setup combined it would probably be around like $10,000. There's no pamphlet to read, you know, the life of a gamer and everything that you have to go through. There's no outline, there's no draft of what to go by. That was a learning experience for sure. Oh my 
God. The team Misfits offered me to join the organization for a percent and money. And obviously that was my best offer at the time. I took it and ever since then they've been treating me the best. It almost happened overnight. They sent me a 12 page contract and I looked it over and I was like, you know, should I show it to everybody? Should I get an attorney involved? And I'm thinking, no, they're gonna pay him to play this game. Why? Let's go for it. It doesn't matter what you play for a game, but as soon as you have a contract, and as soon as you have a salary, you become a pro, no matter what it is, tennis, basketball, baseball, or gaming. Up there and right now, clicks his flexing saying, yeah, I'm in first place, what of it? Man, after six games, two victory L's, one of only two people in top 10 with the two. Probably my best competitive performance was the last week of the solo qualifiers. It was double the money, so I took it so seriously. Are you guys ready for this? OMG, boys. So first off, Clicks qualified. I got first with around like 80 points, and I won 10 grand in just that. Clicks has rise throughout the Fortnite World Cup online opens has been meteoric. A lot of people are wondering how is he going to perform on the stage. So out of over five million for him to kind of make it into the World Cup, it's pretty outstanding. I feel like Young Calculator or Clicks is going to win. It's going to be between Clicks and Tifu, so it's going to be Clicks though. I probably was more nervous than him. There's 18,000 plus people there. Your son is one out of a hundred. You know, you just want the best for him. So I was a nervous Nelly, a parent of someone in the World Series. To me, and to all the gamers out there and other parents, yeah. Yeah, this is our World Series. And then you have the two young warriors out of clicks and Epic Whale, known for taking walls, taking names, and pressing forward, doing everything they can to stop their opponents. Yeah, absolutely. Clicks, one of the players who has fully qualified for both solos and duos. I was duo partners with Skeptic. Played for three days, and that week we qualified. Yeah. So we had three days of practice and somehow qualified. You see clicks I think and Skeptic. Yeah, the, the very young duo from NA East. The trap kill is gonna get the knock! Unbelievable! I could have done better if I had a brain. I kind of played a little bit stupid. I'm happy that I got 18th in the World Cup. Only 100 people in the whole entire world got to compete in the solo World Cup and another 100 in the duos. By far, that's my proudest moments of my career and my life. In the Fortnite comp scene, I probably won over 260 grand just in tournaments from the World Cup and from the Cash Cup from now. I always wanted to be the best, and then when I finally got to the top level, it just went off from there. My stream started growing, everyone started noticing me. My fans definitely inspire me 100%. They always want me to do good in Cash Cups and tournaments, and also my family. Like, they always tell me, even if I do bad in one tournament, you got it in the next tournament. So they definitely motivate me to do better. I'm gonna shoot right, this three, 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 two, two, one. two, one, go. Dead, oh no, crack, crack, crack. Laser, drop it down, I'm dropping down. Frag out, frag out, frag out. I'm sitting up, you frag. Dead? Dead. Dead. Let's go!